Hello guys and welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, we are talking about top 10 most dangerous nuclear weapons. Before we continue our video, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for more videos, so let's get started. A nuclear weapon is an explosive device that derives its destructive force from nuclear fission, nuclear fusion, or a combination of the two. Nuclear weapons are alternately called atom bombs, atomic bombs, A-bombs, nuclear bombs, nuclear warheads, or simply nukes. All nuclear weapons fit into one of two broad categories, fission and combination weapons, or the even more destructive fusion-based designs, which are technically thermonuclear weapons, and may also be referred to as thermonuclear bombs, fusion weapons, hydrogen bombs, or H-bombs. Nuclear weapons unleash enormous amounts of explosive force, which is measured in kilotons, 1,000 tons of TNT, and megatons, 1 million tons of TNT, as well as heat and radiation. They are easily the most fearsome weapons on Earth, capable of producing more death, destruction, injury, and sickness than any other weapon. Which countries have nuclear weapons? 1. Russia, 6,257. 2. United States, 5,550. 3. China, 350. 4. France, 290. 5. United Kingdom, 225. 6. Pakistan, 165. 7. India, 156. 8. Israel, 90. 9. North Korea, 40 to 50. Let's talk about top 10 most dangerous nuclear weapons. 10. MK-14 nuclear bomb, 6.9 megatons. The Mark 14 nuclear bomb was an American thermonuclear weapon designed in the 1950s and was the first solid fuel staged hydrogen bomb in the world. As an experimental weapon, the United States only produced five of these bombs by 1954, testing the device in April of that year during the Castle Union nuclear experiment. Using a non-radioactive isotope of lithium, the nearly 18-foot-long bomb was designed to be delivered by either B-36 or B-47 bombers, due to its substantial weight of 31,000 pounds, and employed a parachute drop method to decelerate its fall to the Earth. 9. MK-16 Nuclear Bomb, 7 Megatons The Mark 16 nuclear bomb was a large thermonuclear weapon based on the Ivy Mike hydrogen bomb. The weapon was the only thermonuclear bomb ever developed to use cryogenic deuterium fusion fuel. Due to the number of vacuum flasks required for this type of fuel, the bomb was extraordinarily large, weighing 42,000 pounds with a length of nearly 25 feet. As a result, a specially modified B-36 was the only American aircraft capable of deploying the weapon. 8. B-53, Mk-53, nuclear bomb, 9 megatons. The B-53, also known as the Mark 53, was a bunker buster thermonuclear weapon developed by the United States military during the 1960s. The bomb was first designed in response to the deep underground bunkers constructed for Soviet leaders during the Cold War. Using a surface blast to collapse the surrounding Earth onto its target, the bomb was designed to inflict massive damage on underground centers, giving the United States a decisive edge in the event of nuclear war. Although much smaller than nuclear bombs from the 1950s, weighing 8,850 pounds and measuring just over 12 feet in length, the bomb had a far greater yield of 9 megatons. At this yield, a B-53 detonation was capable of destroying all structures within a 9-mile radius, with severe burns possible as far as 20 miles. Depending on terrain, researchers believe that casualty rates within 2.25 miles of the blast would be in the vicinity of 90%. 7. MK-36 nuclear bomb, 10 megatons. The MK-36 nuclear bomb, also known as the Mark 36, was a high-yield thermonuclear weapon first developed in the 1950s. Using a multi-stage fusion system comparable to the MK-21, the MK-36 was considered the first dry nuclear weapon ever tested by the United States government. In total, the massive MK-36, which measured over 150 inches long and weighed nearly 17,700 pounds, was capable of delivering a total yield of 10 megatons upon detonation. Using two separate parachutes, the bomb was designed to be airdropped slowly over its target to give bomber crews enough time to escape potential harm. 6. Ivy Mike H-Bomb, 10.4 megatons. The Ivy Mike H-Bomb, hydrogen bomb, was a thermonuclear weapon first detonated on 1 November 1952 by the United States on a new attack atoll. Designed by Richard Garwin, 
The bomb was incredibly massive, with a total length of 244 inches, 6.19 meters, and a total weight of 82 tons. Following detonation, Ivy Mike produced a total yield of 10.4 megatons, creating a fireball with a 2.1-mile radius. The explosion was so powerful and violent that the bomb's mushroom cloud rose to an altitude of 56,000 feet in less than 90 seconds, reaching a maximum height of 135,000 feet. Radioactive debris was reported falling nearly 35 miles away from the blast site, while radioactive fallout remained for several months. 5. MK-24B-24 Nuclear Bomb, 10-15 Megatons the MK-24, also known as the B-24 or Mark 24, was a massive thermonuclear weapon developed by the United States military between 1954 and 1955. Approximately 105 of these devices were constructed in less than a year and were based, in design, on the Castle Yankee series of bomb tests. As the third largest nuclear bomb in size ever constructed by the Americans, the bomb itself was massive, measuring over 296 inches long and weighing over 42,000 pounds. 4. MK-17 Nuclear Bomb, 10-15 Megatons The Mark 17 nuclear bomb, also known as the MK-17, was the first mass-produced series of hydrogen bombs developed by the United States military in 1954. Although phased out in 1957, due to larger, more efficient prototypes that were in development, the MK-17 was an extremely powerful weapon, with a yield approaching 15 megatons. The MK-17 was well known for its weight and size, measuring over 41,500 pounds, with a length of over 7.52 meters, 24 feet, 8 inches. Approximately 200 of the MK-17s were developed between 1954 and 1955, along with several modified B-36 bombers, designed specifically for the bomb's particularities. 3. TX-21 Shrimp, 14.8 megatons The TX-21 nuclear bomb, also known as the Shrimp Thermonuclear Bomb, or Castle Bravo, was a weapon first tested on 1 March 1954 at Bikini Atoll in the Marshall Islands. Housed in a cylinder weighing nearly 23,500 pounds and measuring over 179.5 inches in length, the massive bomb was originally designed as a 6-megaton weapon that used lithium deuteride to power its fission reaction. 2. B-41 Nuclear Bomb, 25 Megatons The B-41 Nuclear Bomb, also known as the MK-41, was a three-stage thermonuclear weapon designed by the United States during the early 1960s. As the most powerful bomb ever constructed by the Americans, the maximum yield of the device was estimated to generate nearly 25 megatons of destructive force upon detonation. The B-41 measured over 12 feet long and weighed over 10,670 pounds and was designed to be carried by the massive B-52 Stratofortress and B-47 Stratojet, with or without parachute delivery. 1. Tsar Bomba, 50 megatons. The RDS-220 hydrogen bomb, affectionately dubbed the Tsar Bomba, was the most powerful nuclear bomb ever built and was detonated by the Soviet Union on 30 October 1961 over Novaya Zemlya, just north of the Matochkin Strait. Delivered by a modified 295V Soviet bomber, the bomb weighed approximately 27 metric tons, 59,520 pounds, and was 26 feet long by 7 feet wide. Due to its tremendous size and destructive power, 50 megatons, a special parachute was constructed to slow the descent of the bomb to Earth, giving the bomber crew time to fly approximately 28 miles away before the Tsar Bomba detonated. Hope you guys enjoyed our video, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for more videos. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.